Hello and welcome to this video tutorial. Today we're looking at adding brushes to the libraries panel in Adobe Illustrator and also using those brushes once they've been added. We're doing this because you can't just drag and drop a brush into the libraries panel and you can't just drag and drop it out of there to use it either. So we'll start by making a brush. In my case, I'm going to make a pattern brush, but you could make any sort of brush that you like. I'm just going to color my star shape that I'm going to make my pattern brush from and remove its fill. With my shape that I'm going to make a pattern brush from selected, I'm going to the brushes panel. You can get to yours by choosing window and then brushes. I'll click here on the plus sign. As I said, I'm going to make a pattern brush, so I'll click pattern brush and click OK. I'm just going to take these default settings, click OK again. Now I can remove my star. The pattern brush is here. I'm going to open my libraries panel. And as hard as I try to drag and drop this brush into my libraries panel, it's just not possible to do it. And when I click the plus sign, all I can add is a fill color. So that's obviously not the method to use. The method to use is to use the brush inside the document. So I'm going to target the brushes tool, make sure I have my brush selected here. And I'm just going to draw something using my brush. Smaller is better because we want to be able to see it when we put it in the libraries panel. Now I'm going to select this object and this I can add to the libraries panel. I'm going to select here graphic. I could do the stroke color, but that's not what I'm here for doing. What I want is that brush. So I'm going to select graphic as my option. And this is now saved in the libraries panel. I'm going to trash this document, so I'm not even going to save it. I'm going to create a brand new document. And here in the libraries panel, not unexpectedly, is our piece of art. You'll also note the brush isn't in the brushes panel. Now, if I try to drag and drop this out of the library panel, I get the option of sizing it. But what I'm getting here is just a graphic. If I go to the layers palette, Let's see what we have. What we have here is just what's called artwork. The brush isn't actually accessible and adding that artwork has not added the brush to the brushes panel. So that's not going to work. The trick is to hold down the Alt key on a PC, Option on a Mac, and then drag and drop this artwork into the document. You're going to get the exact same option except the process of Alt or Option dragging the artwork into the document gives you a different result. Here in the Layers panel, you'll see that we've got something called artwork, but in actual fact, it is this time a stroked path. And because it's a stroked path, this is our brush stroke along the path. And look here in the Brushes panel is our brush. So anytime you want to save a brush into a library in Adobe Illustrator, firstly, make sure that you use that brush inside the document. Grab the object that you've used that brush on and add that to your library. Then when you want to use it again inside another document, remember to Alt or Option drag it into the document. Don't simply drag it because that doesn't get the brush out of the library to be able to be used. I hope you've enjoyed this video. I hope that you've learned things about Illustrator of which you were previously unaware. If you did enjoy the video, please give it a thumbs up, hit the subscribe button and the notification bell, and you'll be alerted when new videos are released. Until next time, my name's Helen Bradley. Thank you so much for joining me here on my YouTube channel.